Hi everyone, this is Asma Khalid from CyberPanel and in today's video we will be learning about how you can fix the out of memory killed PHP FPM error. Now this error will occur when you see that your web server has stopped responding uh, on logging into the server which means that the system uh, is very low on RAM and PHP FPM has consumed most of the RAM. So in this video, I'll be showing you how you can fix this error. So without further ado, let's just jump straight to the video. Okay guys, so what uh, I'm going to use Bitnami via lightsail.aws.amazon.com and within Bitnami, I need to know the location of my pool file. Now that location may differ from software to software and since I'm using Bitnami, the location will be different to that of some other software that you might be using. So you should know your location of your file. So I'm going to access, uh, I'm going to go to that location and access my pool file from there. Now for that, I'm just going to uh, check it out where my pool file is. Okay, so I've, okay. so next I need to access the configuration files. And within my configuration files, I need to check out. Okay, so these are these are all of my configuration files. So, for example, right now I'm going. This is uh, this is the location that I want. PHP FPM dot B. So I'm going to just change it to this. And when I access this, I'll be able to know. Okay, so within this. Uh, uh, location this is the location of my file php fpmd this is my pool file www.conf.default this is my pool file now I want to view the content of this file now for that I'm just going to access this file children Okay, so right off the bat, I know that this is the information that is being given to me. This is the information that is available within this pool file. Now you can see by these semicolons that all of this information is static. It is uh, readable and it is commented out. So I need to access this file so that I can make some changes in it. So for that, I'm going to use the nano command. All right, so now that I have accessed the nano command, I, uh, I can get my information from here. For example, this is it. So my PM is set on demand. My PM max children is being set at 80. So PM is basically a directive with that, uh, which determines the process, uh, how the process manager will control the number of children uh, of the uh, child processes. So my PM process idle timeout is 10 seconds. In the same way, uh, I have all the information that I need right at uh, right in this uh, right at the screen right now. So I can just change it as much as I want, so that I can uh, basically uh, resolve the memory killed PHP FPM error. And once I do that, I'll just simply save this file, and that error will be gone. So this is how you can very successfully uh, diagnose out of memory killed PHP FPM error. So I hope this video was really informative for you guys. If you still have any questions, just drop a comment in the comment section and don't forget to like and subscribe CyberPanel.